this podcast is on subtracting with renaming. Um, subtracting with renaming is basically when you have a subtrahend fractional piece is lower than the minuend's fractional piece. You need to rename the subtrahend in order to make it look bigger. Let's take a look at 3 and 1 third minus 1 and 5 six. Um, first things first is we need to make our denominators the same. So what can a 3 and a 6 both become? Well, they can both become 6. So 3 times 2 and 1 times 2 will make our denominators the same. So we have 3 and 2, 6 is the same thing or equivalent to 3 and a third, and it has the same denominator as 1 and 5, 6. So now that we made our denominators the same, or we made like mixed numbers, we run to our issue. If you look here, 2, 6 is less than 5, 6, and therefore you'll not be able to subtract these. So we need to rename our subtrahend 3 and 2, 6 to make it appear bigger. So what we're going to do is we're going to borrow from the 3 and make that a 2. And since we took a 1 away, we've got to kind of give the 1 back in a fractional form. And we're going to use 6, 6 because our denominators are 6. So basically 2 and 6, 6 is the same thing as 3. Let's add our fractional piece 2, 6 to that. And we end up having all this, which would equal... 2 and 8, 6. So 2 and 8, 6 is the same thing as 3 and a third. It just looks differently. And the great thing here is now we can finally take away 1 and 5, 6. Um, let's subtract our fractional pieces first. 8, 6 minus 5, 6 is 3, 6. And then our whole number second. 2 minus 1 is 1. And we get the answer of 1 and 3, 6. Only issue here is our fractional part, 3, 6, is, could be simplified. Let's go ahead and simplify that now. So we can divide it by 2, or I'm sorry, divide by 3, divide by 3, and we get 3 divided by 3 is 1, 6 divided by 3 is 2, and you keep your whole number 1. So we have 1 and 1 half is your answer. Thank you for watching my video.